Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Erica and today's video is going to be a boy's closet clean out. Not so much the stuff in his closet, but his wardrobe. I really need to get him new clothes and um, he's growing like crazy. So I need to clean out his closet to find out exactly what it is he needs, what it is he has. That way I can shop properly for him. So I'm gonna get that done today. I thought a face-to-face -face intro would be nice because I'm trying to come out of my shell. I'm a little camera shy, believe it or not, so this is hard for me, but I need to do this. I need to do this for me, I need to do this for you. And so um, hopefully I can do uh, more face-to-face -face videos and intros for you in 20 2021. So let's go ahead and start getting this closet cleaned out. So I'm going to give you a little sneak peek of what my son's room looks like before. This is actually not too bad. I've seen worse. He's doing a really good job at keeping his room more tidy. He did have a cousin over a couple of weekends ago and um, they had a lot of fun in his room and that's where a lot of the blankets and pillows are coming from. I'm going to clean out this closet and this is the main reason why I started today's project. We are who we are. I am now going to fold some clothes that I had sitting in a basket. They are clean. What I do when I fold clothes is I'm constantly looking through whatever it is I'm folding and making sure to get rid of things that I know do not fit or that do not look so great anymore. And this is just a constant cycle of getting rid of clothes that are not needed. And I've found that that is very helpful when it comes to cleaning out drawers. The closets are a place that I have avoided, which are all the old clothes that he just doesn't wear at all. And that's pretty much what I'm going to be getting rid of today. But other than that, everything that they use on a daily basis and that I wash, I'm constantly cleaning out so it's now a cycle that is just ongoing and I really love that What I'm doing is making piles of things that I definitely know I do not want and then a pile of things that I might want that I want to look over again later. And once my pile starts getting a little too big, I take it out of the room because I'm trying to make this the least overwhelming for myself possible. And I feel like when the pile is not so huge or it's not growing, it just makes me feel better. So I'm taking the piles out when they start feeling uh, a little overwhelming. Talk 
talking to each other I know we feel the same About the situation Like we're stuck inside a game Time to get out of this circle Yeah, we both carry a scar Let's rewrite the part we're playing Time to cherish who we are The only thing I ever wanted Starts with us taking the chance Not like anything we've done before Oh, oh, yeah Now it's time for something better And time for us to follow our dreams No, we can't stay no more oh. Come run away Okay, so this is what I'm looking at here. I've, I've cleared pretty much everything out. These are all of his shorts and shirts that fit him right now. And then these are extra pajama pants. And then here are a couple of shirts. I'm gonna put anything that's matched on this side and then all of his t-shirts on this side. And so right now this is what he has. And then down in that corner are school shirts that I'm saving for him and just little shirts that were his when he was little. And that's what that is there. But pretty much this closet is emptied out. And now I know what I'm working with because I do need to get him new clothes for the winter. So this is done. I've been needing to do this for a very long time now. Wish I could say I was finally over you But that's not the truth mm -mm. Everyone always keep falling in love again What's wrong with them? I don't understand Maybe it will pass by someone save me For I pass out, I'm too lonely To be done, I'm a drink at this page I decided to leave the hangers here hanging in the closet. That's just a better option for me because me and baskets do not work out. Baskets are just a disaster for me. I never get back to them once I put something in a basket. And then I put these ones here on this side. And then of course, once I start filling his closet with new clothes, I'll have the hangers ready to go for him. I don't expect to buy that many new clothes, but I can also use them when I do laundry. Just come and grab them and take them. And so that is where I am at right now with his closet. And it is a big difference. Um, he definitely needs winter clothes, but as your kids grow, they need new clothes every season. So it's not something out of the ordinary. Now I just know exactly what he has and what I have to work with when I'm out there shopping for him. The bed is clear. I have these here because I want him to try these on. These are the only pair of winter pants that I may keep depending on how they fit him. So I'm gonna have him try those on as soon as he's done with school. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and finish getting his room situated and cleaned up.
I am so glad that I tackled this project today. It wasn't something that I had anticipated doing so soon, but it's done because I really need to get out there and do some shopping. So I hope that this motivates you to get your kids closet cleaned out. Winter is coming and we need to buy a whole new wardrobe and get these growing kids some clothes. So I hope that you enjoyed this. I will see you in my next video. Bye.